today we're going to be unboxing this figure from Amy Amy, not sponsored. Not there yet, guys. Don't worry. Got this figure about a month ago, and I finally got it in the mail. And I'm just really hyped up to open this figure. <laughs> got all the handle with care. Yes, we need to handle this with care. Very fragile, pancake-boy inside. Let's do a little peek. They included this nice little prints. Very kawaii sugoi, if I say so myself. Alright, so this is the back of the box. That's me taking it out of the box. Oh, look at all its glory. So here's the front, a side, another side, the juicy bottom, and finally the top. Looking at the box itself, the art style is just gorgeous. The way they put the whole design together, oh, it's just so beautiful. And I love the little Jack Frost there. Now, Akechi's just trapped in there, but he shall not be taken out yet. Nice little cool feature this box has. If you drop down, whoa, Akechi's face. And then, voila, there he is. All right, guys, so it's finally time to let Akechi out of the box. Let's set him free. Oh my god, I just cracked the box. And then bam, there's his face again. And there he is. Oh my gosh, it's so huge. These my like A scale figures I really ain't playing. Oh. So if you look inside the box, I guess this thing comes out and then you can use it in the background. Holy crap, that is so cool. Oh my god. It says, my sole interest is uncovering the truth. <laughs> Alright, now it's time. Oh, I forget there's tape. Okay, so we're just gonna snap. Yes, I have the same scissors as last video. Yep, we keep it consistent up in here. Mm-hmm. All right, boys, let's do the pool. Hold on. Time for the pool. Hopefully there wasn't a spare part in that. Oh, there actually was a part in that. It was his sword. I am an ASMR channel. All right, so this is part of his sword. Oh my gosh, it's like transparent, like, oh, so beautiful. I don't even want to unwrap him. He looks so crisp. So now we're just gonna take the little plastic things out. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I should have cut that. <laughs> All right, so I took some really cool shots of this figure. Look at that focus, yes. <laughs> Now, I love the amount of detail put into this figure. They really did a great job. Um, every wrinkle, every fold, the shadow work is just amazing. Oh, and that hair. I'm so picky about how they do with Ketchy's hair in some things, but I'm glad they nailed it in this figure. And that base. Ooh, they really did a great job on that base, you know? They could have just done some shitty clear acrylic stand, but no, they really made it unique, and that's what I really like. The base is one of my favorite parts. And I love the pose for this figure. Sculptor did a really great job. And even the tassels are so detailed. I love it. And yeah. Focus. But overall, I think it's a really great figure. One of my favorites. Definitely glad I got it. Bigger than my head. My forearm. <laughs> this figure was only about um, $150, which really wasn't that bad. Um, for the quality, oh my gosh, oh, what the heck, oh, that's just a little dust, wow, I don't even think you can take him off this, can you, I don't even want to try, <laughs> but yeah, that is it for the catchy figure, and now I'm going to review some of the stuff I got from the Atlas store during their final sale. So obviously, one of the things I got from the store was this Akira shirt, and wait till I turn around. I don't think you can see, but it says, oh my god, this is such a hard angle, but it says take your heart on the back if you don't get it, and yeah, it's a pretty dope shirt. So I bought a whole bunch of keychains from the Atlas store mainly. I really like these P3 dancing ones, and I love these All Out Attack keychains. I like the 3D effect it kind of has, as you can see. I like that Makoto one. 
dancing. Getting crazy. And I also got this big ass Mona. I swear, this thing is huge. Yeah, this thing is like 20 bucks and it resells for 80 on eBay. So worth the cost.